Yeah, Rage Force is back on the menu. I'm trying to cheekily sneak in Romans, because I've never played Romans before. So I don't actually know how good they are. And they, they are playing with the Romans up open in Rage Forest community. So I'm, I'm trying to see if they let me play it. No one has said anything so far. Maybe the reason we're not starting yet is because I am Romans. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Well, he, he has not clicked in yet. Be quiet, guys. Don't tell anyone. Hey, Viper, are there any 2v2 tournaments that will happen soon or do they not happen anymore? I'm sure they will happen more 2v2 tournaments for sure, but uh, I don't know of any 2v2 tournament that is coming up anytime soon. And they're letting me be Romans. That is Pog. Let's go. <laughs> guys, this is my first ever game with Romans. And of course, we're doing it on the best map and with Mongols and Koreans allies. That's Pog. I wish I had Khmer ally though for my Scorpions. But yes, we're playing Romans first time ever. And it's on Rage Forest, best map in the world. And we have a pond. We're not pocket though. I need to update myself on the Civ. So Scorpion minimum range is reduced. Um, okay. This will be fine, I'm sure. Wait, did they already wall there? I'm just gonna do... Actually, there's a hill there. A nasty little hill. We should do everything here faster, by default, just by being the Civ. My next massive arena match is tomorrow. Regan's buddy, our Norwegian comrade. Can't say that I noticed the uh, faster collecting and such yet, but maybe actually, because I only had four bills on food the whole time. And I wasn't able to collect 50 food easily. Maybe there is something to it. Yes, Slavs, though, so I would not be surprised if we get like mega pushed. Those are monks again. They have redemption and nine range, or plus three range. So I would say we do have good answers to dealing with potential monk push or siege push. That was freaking Andy. Oh well, yeah, we play against freaking Andy on on Sunday tomorrow. Yeah, they collected. They collect faster. So I wasn't able to like they dropped. And normally the timing they would have worked that the lumber camp finishes in time, since they collect faster. But then again, they should build faster as well, right? Gather, build, and repair. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I guess I started building a bit earlier. I guess it still kind of makes sense. <clears throat> uh, Wait, Vinch is the same classic pro versus Balls, Valas, Ganja team. Uh, what do you mean? Is there something happening right now or what? Like, are they playing right now or something? Oh, delicious World Cup seeding match at Fortin GMT. Ah, what seed are they fighting for? Like, what will be their seed? Wait, uh, so... Wait, I have no idea this was happening. Like, are there are all teams playing today? Like, qualifiers or what? Seed 5 to 8. So there's like invited teams in 
that range that are fight, like playing for seeding or what? As you can tell, I'm very much on top of how that works. Free schedule. But they are invited, right? And they've given like a range and then they play each other for the seed within that range or what? No, it's six or seven, but I get some my sanity play for five to eight. But why would five seed five and seed eight play against each other for seed five? Shouldn't it be seed five and six play each other for seed? Am I just wrong here? Like shouldn't seed five and six play for who gets seed five, for example? Seed 3 and 4 plays for who gets seed 3, and the loser gets seed 4. Isn't that what makes sense when you play for seeding? Because otherwise, why would we play AM for seed 1 then? In the other show match. They don't have seeds yet, they're just 5 to 8-ish. Okay. Roger that. Oh, I completely forgot to fish boom now, because I was thinking. Hard life thinking. Look, I'm the only t guy who walls on our team. I'm the re only responsible guy here. Very disappointing. Very disappointing. You know what? I'm starting to maybe feel a bit of 5%. Eat it! I'm starting to feel the 5%, I think. I mean, it's like playing with 5% handicap, right? Oh, God. Uh, I guess we go up. Yeah, I'm starting to float resources like that I feel like I wouldn't normally have. So maybe I will have to retract my opinion of Romans potentially not being the best save in the game with that 5% bonus. But yeah, let's see how it feels as the game carry on. Yeah, this feels pretty strong. Like, C5 gets first pick of you, AM, so... Uh... Oh, okay, okay. What a teammate, indeed. Oh, he messed up the boar. I will go help him. I mean, fish booming a Roman has to be insane, though. It's only villagers, though, so it's fishing ships are not better all of a sudden, so... That's good, at least. Hey, bro! <laughs> it's right there! <laughs> I stopped it for you! What did he... Oh, he, he wants the other one. Ah, I didn't see the other one. I'm blind. Uh, uh, uh. Don't forget the boar. I'm just gonna let him take care of this. I always hate when people interfere interfere when I'm doing it myself. Oh, buddy is up. He's just stonewalling though. I may have gone up a little bit too fast. That's my build. Oh, actually, or just placing those fish traps? Oh, I missed that. I have missed placing fish traps. Mm. May have gone overkill. <laughs> now did oh god, we're already out of fish. 
Uh, I mean, I made a lot of fishing ships, so that kind of makes sense. It feels like they f finished this really fast, the fish. Still a very quick castlage time, I would say, considering I had the two dock fish boom going in Dark Age. There's been a party over here, for sure. He just hit feudal age. Oh, I didn't do. Oh, so. I chawa. That hurts. Oh, God. Oh, yikes. Why is that open, man? These B Black Forest players, they don't know how to wall. These Rage Forest guys, they need to learn better how to wall. Is he castle dropping? Oh, he's Mayans. Okay, yeah, makes sense. That's why I didn't stonewall, because I knew that. Okay, I have to say, Roman's economy does feel super smooth. Bring you to material with Romans. Well, not necessarily. I'm just, I just want to play them out of my own curiosity. But yeah, it's not impossible that they also become YouTube material. There's a big chance there's a win-win here. Yeah, this would have been a very easy wall, so I imagine he should have done that a little bit earlier, but I mean, it doesn't look like we took any serious damage from it, so it's all good. I can just boom now since he's doing the push. Still need to get on top of my civilization completely. We obviously want to try and probably make some sort of scorpion army. So, Militia Line, Knight Line, and Centurions train 50% faster and receive a charge attack. Do I just play Infantry or... Yeah, I think I have to play, like, Legionnaires. Legionnaires and... Um, Scorpions, right? That has to be the coolest comp that Romans can do. Just do it there. I don't have to go over the top with my greed. But Romans, he will also be okay with less will. Bills. Kind of. He did uh, fortify walls really fast, so he's actually buying a lot of time here. Too bad no Kamara on your team, yeah. Mixing Centurions in your Knights will attack faster, yeah. Or my infantry. Uh, increases movement and attack speed of Nurbe militia line units. Okay, that's gonna, okay, that's our composition. So we're trying to go... Scorpions? Centurions and Legionaries. What can go wrong? Oh, he just did fast imp as well. I like, I like. 
Buying me all the time to do whatever I want with Romans. I respect it. And we should have a pretty sweet economy as well. It's probably already good enough to go imp. Uh, are they in trouble over here? We might have to go the other side at some point. What is this wall? Ah, oh, it's just doing another layer. Looked a bit funny. Okay. Ooh, that castle looks nice. Do a second blacksmith as well. Get those upgrades going. Dude, it's like, it's so warm again today. I really just want to be able to... Oh, no. no. I want to be able to sit in my underwear and play. <laughs> it's just too warm these days. Um, my fear now is that this push of Nach is very good and g game will end prematurely. What is good is Buddy is getting experience for the next Nations event. So let's go. Alright, uh, Scorpion's Gala line attack faster, yes. Yes, we want. Oops. My bad. If a Japanese player converts in Turin, he basically gets champion that attacks 78. What, really? 78% Seven, faster? <laughs> that sounds pretty bonkers. Yeah, I still want to get a satisfactory. Why did I even do? Why did I even do mill upgrades? As if I was ever gonna add farms here. Japanese Romans OP team. What's the Japanese team bonus again? Uh, actually, their bonuses do work well together, but that's probably not what you had in mind. Happen here. There we go. <clears throat> I need space for seed workshops. I need space for barracks. Uh, it's gonna still take some time to get fully up and running. It's still only 28. Well, I say only. It's 28 minutes. So it's not like we're lagging far behind already. But yeah, we'll stop making fish traps soon. And then we're good to go. Okay, let's get this first. Uh, militia line, uh, charge attack, yes. We want the lead. Are they losing on the other side, by the way? No, we have Mo Mongols. We have such good civs there. I believe in the, their abilities to hold their ground. Probably five seed workshops should be enough. And the university. Should probably stop making those. Let's get the lead. And now I prepare barracks. It turned 900. This is also cheaper compared to before. Oof. Score is getting close, though. 
I don't like that. What's if there, Huns? Uh, we shouldn't have too much problems with Huns, right? Oh no. We might have some problems with Huns. No, he walled. I go onager so we can cut through. That was a nice move by him. I didn't see the villagers come. Oh my god, look how beautiful my unit is. My unit is so beautiful. Let's just do rams. They shut that down pretty nicely. Why would he go to the other dock? When you you have a dock right there. Let's do a market. Oh, we have no seed run. I don't like that I didn't take out the outpost. It's full vision of everything I'm doing. As long as they can hold the bottom side, we should be fine. Also, why are they dropping gold off on the TC when the mining camp is right there? Confusion. Yeah, I guess I can do one up here. Uh, I would have probably have to get rid of those houses. Yeah, man, look at the resources now. They're exploding. Maybe this bonus is too strong. Also, like, our... So, Scorpions are 60% cheaper and benefits from ballistics. That's the crazy thing here. So, they are now 30 gold. <laughs> okay, okay. Let's send him some food. Yeah, we are through. I'm obviously not going pikeman. Oh, we actually even have, have halberdier. Okay, we need more of those bad boys. Oh god. Let's go, long swords. Yeah, the stats are not amazing. But still, we're gonna have a lot of scorpions here. Gonna get some legionnaires. We have a Canturian. We're building up towards the dream Roman composition, I would argue. And they have halberdiers now, but I have so many scorpions, right? And we have ballistics on these scorpions. Let's go! Let's go! Show me the power! <laughs> they have ballistics, those helps just died. <laughs> okay, I'm already enjoying this a lot. Oh, they're probably gonna benefit from the fact that like when units run and you have ballistics, you're gonna get like a little bit of extra range by default. Simply due to the fact that with ballistics they like shoot a bit to ch like to chase the unit, right? So the ballista projectile will automatically go a little bit further forward than what you're used to. Why does that not? Usually I could click space there. To like send. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is so good. Wow. Now of course you would expect us to win this fight. But that felt pretty sick. The fact that we also have siege rams on top of this. Is just a little bit mind boggling. Uh, what did I want to... Yeah, let's see. So normally I could do this, that, and space. And it would confirm. That doesn't work anymore, apparently. That's a bit annoying. Another thing introduced. Hello, FJ Vanest. Yeah, how do I stop this now? 
And they're not winning on the other side either, so... Yeah, I'm pretty sure... Well, okay. Uh, to be fair, this is one game sample. Okay? There is a chance... Well, I would say it's very likely. First of all, I need to test them more to know if they're truly overpowered. Oh! What happened? Where are my units? Uh, okay. Not sure why they ran that way, but okay. Uh, this is one game example where I got a free fish boom to enjoy life. So I didn't even take full advantage of the 5% villager bonus, right? But anyway, I'm pretty sure, nonetheless, that there will be changes to Romans before they're coming to ranked. So fear not. I wish there was a an aura thing around the Centurion. Centurion, 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 I think it is. That showed the radius for where it gives the boost to the Civ, right? So I could see, okay, they're within the range now. No, 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 let's fight, let's fight, let's fight. Let's fight, let's fight. Let's fight. Don't resign, don't resign. Let's just fight. So they have 12 plus 9 as a charge attack. Oh my god, this is so... Oh, I, I like this. I'm not gonna lie, I like this. Khmer, Kelt, Roman, Ethiopian. Oh my god, would you imagine? Yeah, I'm just imagining this with the Khmer team bonus. With Khmer team bonus, you have plus one range as well. And you have... Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> they have to... Uh, they have changed this... In, have they changed this into at all? I don't know. Really good armor as well. It's Paladin armor, right? Same armor as Paladin. No, even more. More melee armor than Paladin. But less HP. But more attack. And you have the charge attack as your first hit. Damn, this unit is sick. And it gives... Wait, what? And it gives... Um, wait. Also, they train 50% faster on top of this. Like, this would have been fine with just the charge attack. The fact that they train 50% faster as well. They become like a mini goth. Now, of course, these are 60 food. You don't have supplies. But, I mean, they're worth it for sure. They have one less attack than a champion. But they have more HP. But they have one less attack on the basic attack. But obviously, with the charge attack, you'd probably rather have the charge. They're much more expensive, though. True, they are very expensive. This is probably going to be a unit that you don't want to go, like, you don't want to make 50 of those. You probably want to make, like, 10, 15, and have them be a part of your composition and just try to keep them a little bit alive. Wait, did I? <gasps> Wait, what? No, I did this, right? Wait, what? Why is this? Did I not do this upgrade? No, I did, right? Wait, what? Wait, did I not do this tech? I think I didn't. Wait. It looks like it is a bit brighter. No, I did it, right? Yeah, I did it. I did it. But it feels like this is darker than this one, which indicates that I wouldn't have done the tech, but I think I did it. I'm pretty sure. Yes, I did. Oh, yeah, good. Mm -mm -mm. But yeah, I have to say, of course, I had the perfect game here where I could just fish boom and enjoy life into whatever I wanted to do. I could have tried the knight as well with charge. Yeah, I think this composition is probably what you want to aim for with Romans in most cases. We have legionaries. You could mix in Halbs as well if you if he's only playing cavalry. And then you mix in uh, centurions on the back line, kind of in behind the militia, just to give the bonus. And you try to keep them a bit more alive. And then, of course, scorpions, onagers. You have siege ram as well. I think siege... Having Siege Ram as well on top of this is going to make it super... Like, pushing with Siege Ram, Legionaries, Few Centurions, and Scorpions is going to be the play here, I believe. Yeah, first impression, Civ feels super smooth to play. The ec economic boost is surely great. How it plays out in like 1v1 Arabia, though, for example, I would not know. Because they don't have the, the best compositions for 1v1 Arabia that we see today. So, um, I'm still not sure if they would beat, for example, Chinese in 1v1 Arabia. But um, it definitely feels really, really powerful.